Um, that comes down to self-awareness, I think. Um, I know that my body language will reflect my mindset, so if I'm aware of how I'm feeling, then I can probably check in easier with how that might look on the outside and how I'm holding myself. Um, and it can be a really powerful thing to get yourself out of a rut. If you notice that you're not feeling 100% and you could change something like your body language, that can lift your mindset as well. Um, and sometimes you're playing with teammates who know you really, really well and are able to kind of pick up on whether you are um, feeling a bit low in energy or um, you know, in a positive space just based on how you're carrying yourself. So um, yeah, I, that's about all I can say about that really. Yeah, and I think um, you know, uh, body language in sport is really powerful. You not just bowls, look outside of bowls and it can almost be that sort of cutting edge over your opposition mm. as well. Um, you know, in the sense of if you want to come across tall and energetic, you can do that, you know, via your body. Um, you might not be thinking it fully, but, you know, fake it till you make it sometimes, and mm -hmm. that can also play into your brain as well and give you that extra boost of adrenaline that you might need.